Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. Derek reacts back at it again. And yes, Frankie goes to Hollywood. The Power of Love, 1984. Not to be confused by the Celine Dion one. Um, I don't know. Could it be the same one? I don't know. Um, that'd be interesting to find out. But uh, it's a Patreon request and we'll be taking a look at the official video. Love me some 80s. You know that, guys. And yes, I'm officially back. Back from vacation. Um, it almost felt like a month. Um, probably felt longer for you guys. Did you guys miss me? Please let me know if you did. I missed you guys. Let me know down below. Um, can't wait to get my hands on this. Let's get right to it. Before we get into the video, please take a moment. Comment, like, and subscribe. Makes videos like these all the more possible. And also, join Patreon today. If you do, you'll be able to help support the channel and request videos like these. All the support is gladly appreciated, guys. Also, check out my store, DerekReacts.store. A lot of custom tees, designs, inspiration made possible by you guys and my music journey. A lot of cool stuff there, guys. I actually had a sale last week, if you guys um, saw that. But... A lot of cool, neat things. Check it out, guys. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and on Spotify, where all my Derek React hits make the cut. All right, guys, without further ado, let's go. like fire I'm so in love with you purge the soul interesting huh make love your goal the power of love a force from So what a drastic turn this is for Mr. Frankie. <laughs> Frankie goes to Hollywood. Um, uh, the reason why I say that is because Relax was very, very up-tempo, guys. Up-tempo. Um, and very, very energy-driven. And we saw that video, how, how, how banana that was. That was a complete, completely bananas, that, that video. I mean, um, like literally, like it was completely insane um, and very explicit, right? For its time, right? For its time. We've seen more crazier stuff than that. Uh, nowadays but he's slowing it down here drastically very this is a battle guy about ba ballad song and it's um a biblical almost biblical type of like uh, very suitable for this time time of year um as we approach the hol holiday season um and i don't know if it was released around this time was it probably was probably was so it kind of fits really nicely in there it's okay i guess it's okay i i haven't latched onto it fully yet um and I guess I guess the chorus is 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 okay too. Uh, let's continue. Let's see. See if there's any surprises. Ah. 
கேட்டதா This time we go sublime Love is entwined divine divine Love is danger Love is pleasure Love is pure the only treasure Ah uh, this voice is so good Nice sense. I like the sense. Make love your goal. Beautiful. Look at that. And there's baby Jesus. The three kings. Nice, nice. Oh. I love it. Keep the vampires from the door. Interesting, that's interesting. I gotta say, I actually enjoy this video. This video was actually really good. Um, and it was very visually, you know, I was visually attentive and everything to it. Um, it kind of like kept me glued to the screen and, and watching everything as it unfolded. You know, you get to see the, the, the whole thing unfold um, uh, with, with, with the whole, um, you know, aspect of, 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 uh, of, of baby Jesus. And you get to see the three kings. Um, you see Mary, you see the whole thing there, you know, unfold before her eyes. Uh, very, very suitable for Christmas time. And what I like about it, um, about this one, is that it differentiates itself, stands out from the rest of all other Christmas songs. Um, if, in fact, it was released in Christmas. I mean, I'm thinking it was. I'm thinking it was. It is. It does have all of those vibes, and it's perfect for this. So, um, lyrically, this is a good one, guys. Lyrically, it's a good one. And even instrumentation, the instrumentation to this is really, really good. Um, I, I like the the uh, the way it's kind of like fleshed out with instrumentation, and you get all these different um, interesting breaks and surprises with that, um, especially the synths and even the string arrangements and all those things. But I think the tempo is a little bit just too slow for me. Um, I think that I had a hard time. Um, it just it just didn't like it. It was just too slow. It was a little bit too slow for me. Um, you know, it's like it's like almost six minutes long, almost I think it was, but um, that's how I feel about it. That's how I feel about it. Uh, what a drastic difference this is from Relax. I mean, you're talking about two polar opposite type of videos, and and songs, because you have a very very naughty, raunchy song, Relax, um, and you know you take that in the video and stuff like that. Versus this one, it's like it's like completely night and day. You know, two polar opposite videos. Um, and you know, uh, Frankie decides to go to church, he decides to go to church. Um, and he, uh, you know, he, he, he really goes all out with this one, um, and with instrumentation and all his, all of the, that ballad, this ballad type of song that we get written by Holly Johnson, Peter Gill, Mark O'Toole and Brian Nash for the four members of the band, four of five members of the band. It was released in the group as their third single issued as a single 19, uh, in 1984, November. So yes, it falls into that. For Welcome to Pleasure Dome, The Power of Love followed its two prede uh, predecessors of Relax and Two Tribes, like the one I mentioned, to top the UK's chart, and it was the second um, the band on early December number one. So there you have it. The Power of Love was also a top 10 hit in European countries, Australia, New Zealand, and Canada, and is often regarded as a Christmas song. That's what I was talking about. 
uh, despite having references to Christmas within the song's lyrics. However, the accompanying video features the nativity scene. That's what I was trying to talk to you guys about. Um, I couldn't I couldn't figure out that word. It couldn't, just couldn't come out. I don't know why. And it was uh, the cover as the Assumption of the Virgin. Um, the single spent just one week, number one in the UK, out, outsold by the charity single, Do They Know It's Christmas by Band-Aid. I think I've heard this one before um, in 1997. It was the best-selling single ever in the UK. So there you have it. Holly, jo Holly Johnson, who co-wrote the song, later reminisced, I always felt like The Power of Love was a record that would save me in this life. There is a biblical aspect to this, spiritually, and passion. The fact that love is the only thing that matters in the end. And there's that. There's that. So it's it's very versatile in, in its in its in its in its in, in a way where um, people can classify it as a Christmas song, but it can be listened to all all year round because it doesn't have when you listen to it, it doesn't have all those jingles and and all those things that that the typical Christmas song has. You know, that's what I was trying to explain. The power of lore, of love, a force from above, cleaning my soul. The power of love, a force from above, a skyscraping dove. Flame on, burn desire, love with uh, tongues of, of fire. Purge the soul, make your love goal. Make your love your goal. Um, very emphasized too in the song. I'll protect you from the hooded claw. Keep the vampires from your door. Oh, so good, so good. Very good lyrical, lyrically type of good song um, by by uh, Frankie Goes to Hollywood. Um, but this one, it's it's not it, it's not not every song has to be catchy. But I just didn't it, I just didn't latch on. I didn't latch on, guys. That's how I feel about it. Let me know what you think about this one down below. I'm loving to hear your, uh, I'm very curious to know what your thoughts are about this one and other um, songs from them. Until next time, for more videos like these, guys, take care. Hey, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see more videos like these, be sure to check this one out. And also, take a moment to comment, like, and smash the subscribe button to stay on all the latest reaction videos. And guys, yes, I have a Patreon link. Be sure to check that out when you get a chance. Help support my channel. Makes recommendations like the one you just saw all the more possible. All right, guys, take care. Love you guys. Peace.